Hey everybody, it's NCP. I need to pick your guys' brains for some ideas. Um, as you know, I'm working on the uh, Fallout slash uh, Star Shelter. This thing's gonna have a uh, you know a panels on solar panels. Um, I don't know how many, probably two, so probably 200 watts, maybe more. Well, maybe two, two. <clears throat> so I'll just put those outside. But I got the inverters, and I'm gonna use a um, well for now. <clears throat> I'm gonna use a. Uh, a gel cell battery, uh, 12 volt, I don't know how many, like car battery size, I don't know how much watts it's off of hand, or half hours. <clears throat> and then we're going to eventually go to lithium ion phosphate, but not right now. So I bought all the stuff, I've been buying, you know, inverters and power controls and breaker panels and all kinds of fun stuff, right? Cables, everything, right? <clears throat> so I got to thinking, what now? Obviously, I'll have a Raspberry Pi in there, and it'll have entertainment and, you know, music and whatever, you know, and internet, etc., right? Um, but after that, I'll have it monitor outside conditions, you know, with my, my weather station. I hear all Wi-Fi into that. So these things are all, they're not, they're not grid-dependent things, but I'll have it to, like, what am I going to do with the other times? Um, it's just going to sit there, you know, it's not doing anything. So I'm thinking that I'll have a, a cloud server. I'll put it down there and have it run the cloud server, which is maybe access one one time every two weeks, if, if of that, and just for backups. Well, I guess once a week then. Okay, so I'll do backups. And um, other than that, maybe I'll have it charge my tools, my battery pack tools. But other than that, I don't really have a use for it. What, what, what project should I have, you know? Um, what, what should I attach to these solar panels? I don't want to waste the free solar energy. I want to use them for something, you know? I want it active, you know? Like like out here on the, the chicken coop thing over there, there's a solar panel on top and it runs a fan all the time. Well, all the time there's light. Um, it does have a charge controller inside, but there's no battery hook to it. Um, cause I'll have the other thing now, but I can use this to charge my phones, but I'm not going to leave my phone down in the basement, you know, while, while it's charging. So I'll have to charge off the power pack and stuff like that. Maybe I'll run an outlet to the room up here with an inverter, but that's probably not going to happen. Let's be honest. I don't feel like it out of the house, but either or that's one thing, but, but up there it runs whenever there's sun on or solar, it will take and um, run that fan so there's fresh air in the chicken coop all the time and lowers the temperature. So what should I do with the other power when I do this other thing? I mean, I, I don't know what to run in there. I mean, I'll put a camera inside so I can monitor it, but I'll, basically when, when there's not a storm or, God forbid, fallout or, or something terrible where I need to shelter in place, um, this thing's going to be pretty much used for my tools. Um, like I'll put my drill press in there, and, you know, I can't put a table saw in there because I never get boards in long enough, won't fit, but table saw, maybe, maybe, you know, something else. Not, not table saw, I'm sorry, drill press, grinder, things uh, that'll throw metal all the place. So let's keep it contained, let's, you know, sweep it up real easy and sweep it up. Um, and if we ever need it for a storm for more than a couple hours, or I'll just push that stuff out in the middle of the shop and say, oh, well, you know, and just, you know, make it pretty later. But maybe I'll put some food storage on there. I don't know. We'll see. But what what should I use the solar panels for? And I can add more power panels. I've got um, yeah, eight, eight 100 watt panels. I could make an array. I'll, I'm not going to get on the roof because I don't know if it holds my roof. And I, I want temporary panels where I can take them up and down as needed. So. I mean, I'll leave like two up all the time, but I was going to mount them to a tree or something, or maybe on a pole. I, the, the, the clean area in the house, uh, where the solar's clean, you know, no trees or anything, is on, on the other side of the house, and I don't want to run it, so I'm eventually going to go to a 48 volt system, so I can have the same amount of watts, but less, uh, less, uh, wire size. It, it, it's a money thing. <laughs> It'd be cheaper. But what can I, what are your ideas for solar? What should I use this free energy for? Um, it's just be a little bit. I thought about just running like some astronomy software or whatever. And no, that's too too much. So I can have security backup for the DVR. I can have it down there. Sure, I can do that. 
these are all low power things, but I don't know what else to do that's fun. You know, like, like I can have a ham radio, which I'll have down there. And when I'm, when I'm using it, I'll have a ham radio on down there. A little ham radio, 10 meter to 60 meter, or to 180 meter, I think. So I can use that as, as data logging. Maybe I'll make a node. Maybe I'll use a Raspberry Pi. I want the Raspberry Pi to do something all the time since so it's down there. So I was thinking maybe I'll set up a, a Telnet BBS because, because that's fun. It pleases me. Or an old BBS from back in the day with, you know, Telnet. Or I don't need a web server because I have a web page, which I never even work on, but I got one. So there's no point in that. Or, or maybe one day I will, but not, not today anyway. But I need some ideas, guys. What kind of solar power projects would you guys do if you have, well, a lot of time and... You can do it yourself and, uh, you know, no more than 800 watts, obviously, but I'm not going to have 800 watts for seven hours a day. I'm not going to do anything like that. So not, it's, this, this isn't meant to run the house or really even supplement the grid in any way. Um, it's just something fun that keeps going. Like, like I said, the, the chicken coop has a fan on it and solar panel. That's nice. That's needed, you know. Um, automation would be good if I could figure out something to do, but I'm here to pick your brains. Um, let me know what you guys think, um, what your ideas are. All ideas are valid. Everything's great. Um, the most computing power <coughs> will be a Raspberry Pi, uh, probably a four. I have a five, but that's upstairs. That's my fun one to do, you know, ham radio stuff on, but we'd probably run a Raspberry Pi four. So, uh, 20 some watts or whatever. Um, it doesn't have much computational power, so you couldn't do any type of, a well, anything with really, with it. you couldn't do any other much web browsing or maybe telemetry or data. Um, yeah. So there will be Wi-Fi down there. Um, maybe I'll put one of the, the hubs down there for Wi-Fi because I only have one inside the house anyway to get to the sump pump outside. So, yeah. So smart switch, I could, I could do some bad uh, automation with that, some, uh, as a, a Wi-Fi router, I could do that. Um, you know, power and Alexa down there, obviously, which I have my shop, which I, I rarely use, but I have it play, I have it stream Amazon Music, so I was going to just stream the music with the Pi, but I'll just, no, I think about it, just plug in a USB port and put in the Alexa down there, so that'd be fine. But other than that, I don't know what to do. Um, let me know. I'm still in the designing phases. You know, I still got a lot of work to do on this thing. But let me know. Um, let me pick your guys' brains. All right, so this is NCP. Um, you guys, I hope everybody's safe and having a good time. All right, have a good one. NCP out.